What I'd like to do is tell a story with all of your help. Celtic Madeline. The pile created parodies and generally made fun of by Lord Lucas Messmer. Give me a noun. Volunteer person? Cheese. No, give me a verb ending in in. A noun. Axe. A noun. Move. And noun. Shoe. Noun. Tramistat. <laughs> Next in the Celtic Mad Libs, we need a noun. Phaser. <laughs> Plural noun. The Book of Kells. <laughs> Myocardial infarction? <laughs> <laughs> that works. That is better. Adjective. Uh, uh, smelly. Ooh, bad adjective. <laughs> <laughs> um, smelly. All right, better. Yeah, smelly. Verb ending in ing. <laughs> Crushing. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking swishing, but that's <laughs> <laughs> what I Lightsaber. <laughs> Adjective. That's, that's an interjection. <laughs> Noun. Eye patch. Noun. Arbard. Arbard Tubo. Sanitation engineer. <laughs> Verb ending in ed. Retreated. Pinching hands. I'll use them all. What the hell? Body parts. What? No, it's hair. Noun. Earwax. Bear. Plural noun. Petunias. Verb ending in ing. Singing. Last but not least, that most popular request, <coughs> noun. Radio. Rhino Telexomania. <laughs> Godzilla. Darian can spell radio. <laughs> Darian. Darian is a noun? Proper noun, yes. <laughs> or in this case, an improper noun. <laughs> yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, so nice lords yeah. and ladies, words and ladies, you other people, <laughs> I bring you... A treatise on Celtic beliefs. One important Celtic religious event was the May Day cheese of Belfast, <laughs> marking the slaying of summer. <laughs> According to the Irish Act, the druid, or priest, invoked the god of moose and shoe to restore <laughs> abundant herds and plentiful crops. Huh. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Beltane was in many ways like a modern religious premistat, combining <laughs> solemn rites with a joyful phaser, <laughs> a fair, and a day of myocardial infarction <laughs> during the dramatic and smelly live reading of the Book of Kells. Did you see what they serve at the fair? <laughs> Good get a myocardial infarction. During the dramatic and smelly live reading of the Book of Kells. <laughs> the eve of Beltane, however, was a sashaying and unsettling time. <laughs> In the night dividing spring from lightsabers, the turn and cattle could become Arr! <laughs> <laughs> blind in one eye. <laughs> unless unless the druids offered eye patch and a sanitation engineer in a hoopalage. Uh, just so with dads to the perfect life and a color like mauve to their god. The Celtic belief that an inching hand corseted as attracted by labial fricatives <laughs> and nose hairs could plead for the living made them a worthy earwax to Bellinosa. <laughs> and because fire was sacred, cattle driven through the smoke of petunias <laughs> that almost makes sense. <laughs> were believed to be singing and ensure health and rhylotelectomania. <laughs> if, however, rhylotelectomania were not forthcoming, the Celts were stalwart in their belief that Godzilla was assured. <laughs> How about that? Wow.